Yes, welcome back to next gen blogger and in this video i want to show you how you can use the d logo feature in vscc free video editor now d logo in general is used for removing logos or watermark from any video or image and you can totally use that for that purpose but to me d logo has always been the feature using which i can blur certain parts of a video or image and uh, i will show you why i say that because if you actually go to video effects and if you go to filters we have this blur options present with us we have the box blur we have the stack blur we have the gaussian blur and we have the motion blur but the problem with all this blur options which are there is that they blur out the entire image or they blur out the entire video and um, if you are looking to blur out certain part of an image or certain part of a video then it really becomes difficult using this blur options and so in that case what you will make use of is the d logo feature which is present right here using which you can blur out certain parts of a video or certain parts of an image so let's get started now as you can see i've already imported a demo image in the editor and uh, let me just first click on the image now let me just go to video effects let me just go to filters and let me just select d logo now let me just quickly click on okay now look inside the d logo filter settings which is present inside the properties window and as you can see there are two options present the first is presets and the second is level so if you actually click on the presets drop down menu we have a couple of different variations for the d logo so we have pixelate we have box blur we have lens blur we have mosaic and we have gaussian blur and the levels option will help us to um, increase the level of our blur so let's get started let me just quickly um, let's just say let me just i want to blur the face of this little guy right here and so as you can see i have used the d logo selection area to cover the entire face of this guy and um, let the preset be pixelate only currently the level is 0 so let me change that to 2 and as you can see i've successfully blurred the face of this little guy right here and uh, let me just change the preset from pixelate to box blur as you can see this is the box blur preset let me just change the preset to lens blur this is lens blur preset let me just change it to mosaic and finally let me just change the preset to gaussian blur so these are different presets which are available in the d logo filter settings and you can use any one of them as per your use similarly you can use the levels option to increase the level of blurring which you want in your video or image so that's it guys that's all i wanted to share with you uh, in this video how you can actually use the d logo feature you can by the way totally use the d logo feature to remove logos and watermark so let's just say if this is the uh, watermark right here so let me just quickly take the selection area to that place and um, i can actually hide that watermark behind the uh, d logo selection area so that's it guys do share with me your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching